Hey Kayla Crew, I am back here with another Bangor Slayer, you feel me, update. I am feeling a whole lot better. I'm not sick. I have been quarantining and my quarantine is pretty much over. I feel a lot better. My head pains, everything is gone, you know. I feel so much Anyway, better. as you can see by the title, I will be doing a synthetic wig review and also just getting myself together today. I've really been in a dark place lately. I haven't been able to upload. I want to get on a YouTube schedule, so I will be uploading a video about a YouTube schedule soon. There's just been a lot of going on. I had to cut off a lot of people for my self-wellness and for just to make myself feel better, I just had to let go of so many people because it wasn't beneficial for me. I was in a dark place and no one was checking up on me. And I thought people cared about me, but obviously they have their own lives and I don't blame that. But I just need to separate myself from a lot of people. And that's what I had to do. And that's why I haven't been able to upload because I've been doing things to help myself feel better. But now that I'm coming out of this dark place, I would like to share my life with you guys and upload more content. So I hope you guys like what you heard and like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for this video so you can see how I slay this synthetic wig. So you guys, it's the wig review and it's called Secret Collections Hair and it is so beautiful. So let's get out the package. And the curls and the waves on it, I love, absolutely love. Comes with this thing to keep it nice and together and that's what the body of the wig looks like and that's what the front it has a lace um i think there's some baby hairs we can finesse up in here yeah they got some baby hairs um and it's a middle part so that's what i like about it, it has a middle part and then it has a clip right here and straps and a clip at the bottom so what we're gonna do is I know I don't have the right color wig cap so you guys can get on me about that but it's okay I'm gonna make it work though because if there's a wheel there's a way so what I'm gonna do is I'm just trying it on right now just to see So I'm already really liking the waves and everything. I got some hair stuck up under there. But let me go get my brush and I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I am back and I just brushed out this one side. And so this is the side that's brushed out and this is the side that's not for comparison of what it would look like before you touched it and after you touched it. And I'm loving, loving, absolutely loving this. We're probably going to put some concealer I got from the beauty store as well where I got the hair. I go to Diva's Beauty Supply. So I got this duo. I also got these super cute studs and hoops. And I got silver. I usually get gold, but... My nose piercing is silver, so I wanted to get some silver hoops. I also got these lashes, and also my package came in with my beautiful earrings, my favorite earrings. Emerald green diamond snake earrings. They are so pretty, and it's by Lux V Jewelries. If you want a 15% off, use my promo code right here, and you will get the most quality beauty jewelry for a budget. You know, you want to look good, but you got a ball on a budget, okay? And I'm going to show you guys how to ball on a budget, okay? This weave right here, lace front, was $50 okay you cannot beat that and it's and it's soft it's smooth it's not shedding 
sixty dollars. You can't you can't beat that. These earrings were about six dollars. You can't beat that. Look at how how many earrings are on that. So so cute. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut this out. I can find my scissors. If I could find my scissors, one second. So I found my scissors, and I'm just gonna cut this little tag thing off of here because it ain't cute at all. We don't want it on the wing, of course. So we just cut that thing off. What I'm gonna do is brush the other side now, since I showed you guys the comparison. And look at that, look at that. That is so beautiful. I love, absolutely love, love, love this hair. Oh my. And then the lace, you guys. I'm gonna melt this lace, okay? So, I will be back to show you how I'm gonna melt this lace. So after I cut this little lace piece off, I left myself about this much lace just so I could melt the lace and show you guys what I'm talking about. So next step is I'm gonna take my got to be glue, but first I'm gonna brush my hair back. And once I brush my hair back, um, I'm gonna get that got to be glue spray and I'm gonna spray it on the lace. Um, problem is that on the applicator thing, the glue dried, so, and I don't know if you guys heard about that Gorilla Glue girl, but if you haven't, you've been sleeping under a rock, but honestly, that Gorilla Glue girl, she ran out of got to be glued spray, and she used freaking Gorilla Glue. And it says heavy duty on the bottle. Who does stuff like that? And now she's trying to sue the company. Lord help the bear. Anyway. So we're going to get into laying this lace. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray got to be glued all over the lace part. Like so. So that's what I'm going to be doing. But I'm going to use a mirror for reference and just to help me out. I'm gonna just spray all over that lace line right there. So what I'm gonna do. So after I've sprayed a good amount of that got to be glued, I'm gonna take my blow dryer and I'm just gonna blow dry that part right there. I'm also gonna take a comb while I'm doing that and just go over the lace while I'm drying it just so I know it's getting laid. Add some more got to be glued to the corners of the hair where it's kind of closer to the ear so it just looks all natural and laid down so what I'm gonna do is pull the hair back from my ear like so and just pull it back and then spray some more got to be glued near the corners so up under my hair a little bit just just those areas and I'm gonna dry that
so after that's all dried, it should be pretty much laid. Uh, whatever corners you see could be fixed. Um, press them down and hold them. That's what I do. So I'm just holding this little piece in the corner that was kind of lifting because it was still drying, but it just didn't have much hold to it. Um, but as you can see, it is laid. I'm moving my eyebrows. Nothing's lifting. It is laid, you guys. That's how you lay. Use that got to be glue. Do not use no Gorilla Glue. There is Gorilla Snot, which is a gel for the hair. And maybe that's why she thought it was cool because she mistaked Gorilla Glue for Gorilla Snot. I don't, she was tripping, absolutely tripping. So, y'all, this hair is really nice. I'm so glad I got it laid. So you guys, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got some tips on how to lay your lace front. And like, comment, subscribe, join the Kayla crew and stay updated with new videos. We'll be coming out with a schedule soon, so stay tuned with all that. Thank you guys. Hey,